That's imagination. Buggy. Ah, a perfect squiggle is born. I think I will call it pudding. Because it reminds me a bit about a pudding, don't you think? All I got to do to bring pudding to life is to give it a pair of eyes. Now that pudding's got eyes, it's quite easy to find the mouth. There it is. And when you have the eyes and the mouth, the rest of the man just falls into place. Nose, ears, eyebrows, moustache and body. And we have a genuine Italian opera singer. Let's try it again. The eyes leads us to the mouth. That leads us to the body and the tentacles. Now we have a sea monster. But what will happen if we move the eyes down here? Then we discover something entirely different. A tortoise. Or how about moving the eyes in here? Now you have a hedgehog. You see, this is imagination. Wherever you direct your imagination, you will find things. You can keep moving the eyes around and you will find an endless amount of ideas. Now, what do you think will happen if you take away the eyes and replace them with a car instead? Then you will need a road. And before you know it, you have a whole landscape. By adding different things to the squiggle, ideas will come to you. Let's say if you add a ship, you'll get a wild ocean. If you add a snowman, you get a winter landscape. Or just add a fly and you'll get a... That's right, a pudding. Now sit back comfortably and allow my pudding to take you on a little tour of the imagination. <laughs>